Ow. No. It's not a parrot video, it's a purge update video. Part, don't know, take, misc. Yeah. It's been about over a year since the last one, and uh, we're on lockdown in the UK for a little while longer. Uh, but like some people, what are you doing? <laughs> but like a lot of people, I'm on lockdown, uh, staying at home. Doing very little, because unfortunately I currently classed as unemployed. So I've got time now, just don't have money. So I've been basically playing stuff uh, and deciding if it's worth keeping. For the most part, the answer was no. As you can tell, the PS2 shelf is no longer full of stuff. The Wii shelf is no longer over full. Uh, that's stuff that I played. I played, them, I played them and most of them I just couldn't get on with. Uh, another code R was fun but it's boring. Uh, I'm playing other things. I actually like Real Heroes Firefighter, but I've got to a glitch. Uh, museum rescued the paintings, put out a fire. Unfortunately, the fire doesn't want to go down. Restart the level, same problem. Restart again, same problem. I'm not restarting the game. Uh, I got rid of some Mega Drive games as well. Uh, another big thing that I got rid of was uh, these. This, these two shelves were double stacked for like VHS and DVDs. I went for a thing during lockdown. I'm going to put a counter for every time I say lockdown. <clears throat> and I just ended up watching them all and decided if they're worth keeping. A lot of them weren't. The biggest culprit was the anime stuff, VHS anime. Anime on VHS. Uh, because a lot of that was naff. <laughs> and there's a fair few things that I'm, I'm just selling because I might upgrade to DVD at some point. <clears throat> <clears throat> Sorry, I'm recovering from a cough. So, yeah, that's gone as well. Uh, which is great, because if I'm never going to watch it again, what's the point in, own, in having it? What I've got left here is all stuff I'm happy to re-watch. Yeah, I do want a virtual boy. Unfortunately, it's got the screen issue. And... <laughs> You're being distractingly cute. Go there. Go there. Yeah, uh, play Wii games, getting through them slower. Because, uh, as we all know, the Wii's got a lot of crap on it. And I don't you nearly bit my foot then, you little prig. Uh, <laughs> PS2's next. Uh, but yeah, some of the. Some of the stuff I've sold recently, the money's come in handy because, like I say, I'm unemployed. Unemployment benefit, benefit, unemployment benefit. And unfortunately, that's not a lot. I think calculations, deductions, and that. I've got twenty pound left each week for food, gas, and electric. <sighs> Great. Uh, hopefully, that's starting soon. Because uh, I've. I've I just asked if we could get in any free courses, and they said, yeah, you can do all sorts, you can do a fault, you can do a fault lift truck driving course. So, all right, I've already got experience, game-wise. Uh, I did a play of that years ago, and it's, uh, it's, uh, and otherwise, I spent some of the time just uh, doing stuff I needed to do around the flat, because I'm now here most of the time. A lot of stuff has been niggling me. Stuff like cleaning certain parts of the flat, and this as well. I put up an old photo. Uh, essentially, all the systems were stacked at one point, which doesn't look very good. And it's also awkward. Now, I've, I've recently put more shelves in. Uh, I wasn't I'm not happy with having a white shelf sticking out. Wood panelling matters. Uh, I also got rid of the TV unit. Well, not got rid of it. It's in the kitchen waiting for somebody to want to have it. Because I got a Hadda 21 in CRT. That went today. Uh, and hopefully the guy who bought it off me is going to get enjoyment out of it like I did. Because it was a good CRT. I just wanted to make it bigger. Because I sit on the sofa here. My eyesight's not very good on long distance. I've got glasses. Wear glasses. 
Uh, I've been playing a few games on the sofa and with the TV. I don't need my glasses on. That on your brand. Uh, that. And not only I bought that, like, when was it? I think it was like two weeks before lockdown started. <laughs> with the whole aspiration of making it good. You know, improving it. Because they do, they do need work on them for them to be decent. <clears throat> Mainly think with that one, it's uh, something to do with the joystick encoders being rubbish. You do rapid tap moves and they won't work most of the time. Other things, I've been doing projects, like you can see my cackle demons, uh, getting into making helmets. These are wearable. Uh, that's Mega Man, that's uh, a random judge one. I've been making more, because I've got a project bag. Uh, but yeah, uh, I'll show you other things. And as a few people will know, I do games events. I hire stuff out. I lend stuff out. Uh, I provide myself for doing such a thing. So I have a lot of stuff. Now, I'll put a picture of what this used to look like. Here. And now it looks like this, which, yeah, I know, that's there. Uh, there, there. They are there. Uh, that's, like, broken systems stuff that needs stuff for projects. Uh... System drawers, controllers on the left, all organised, so you've got like Nintendo, Sega, blah blah blah, computer leads, PSU, PSUs for normal TVs, TV leads for everything, and PSUs, and a couple of boxes up there because that's it, put that in the other day. <laughs> Empty boxes, uh, anybody want any type of drum master boxes? <coughs> yes, I know the Sega might activate. Again, all the stuff I actually bought with the money. And that's the DVDs and VHS tapes I'm getting rid of. People want me to post them. I did just. <sighs> yeah. Uh, like I've been buying 4.3 LCDs. This is a recent. This is a thing. It's a wonderful thing. Because, again, I do events and. CRTs are nice. They're nice. I like, I like using CRTs, but. For the simple thing known as convenience, in the space you put one 40 inch CRT on a van, you can get probably three 4.3 LCDs. And you know what? You get every connection you need. The picture quality on them is really good, really clean. <coughs> and they just. It looks professional when you've got more of the same type. Buying loads of the same CRT is hard. Buying loads of... I've been scouring all, all over Manchester for these. And Bolton. Uh, it's just to get them. And they're great. But, yeah. As I said, I noticed the change. The change in mindset. Because uh, I have seemed to have got into the phase in my brain where... I'm just thinking, I don't need this. I don't need all this stuff. Uh what good is like owning loads and loads of things you're never going to use? It's it's like a hoarder's mentality. <clears throat> and when you get to the whole hoarding situation, you get to the point where you end up just spending too much money on stuff. And unfortunately for me, money is incredibly limited at the moment. I'm kind of relying on savings to live. You know, to buy... Like, I had to buy a new pair of shorts the other day. I had to buy bike bits, and thankfully I had savings, otherwise I wouldn't have been able to buy them. And I use my bike for basically getting food. Because, uh Whereas the shops are, like, I think it's a half an hour walk up the road. It's also a half an hour walk back with shopping, and I don't rely on public transport. I try not to, because as a whole, public transport isn't reliable. And during these lockdown times, uh the buses are just terrible. <laughs> Germs! <laughs> but yeah, that's about it, really. Uh, yeah, that's all. Uh, I'm going to sit down and play some games, because talking about them makes me want to play. 
Anyway, tatty bye.